Do you just take daily news online, you mean? Yeah. 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 I mean, that's we haven't really been in contact with that many people other than just basically looking for. I know I talked Who's to Weston. Comments about I talked to Weston Price, which was like the big, the big study we gave you. Yeah. I got a. I got a hold of them, and they gave me some. Have you talked to your dentist? Any of you? No, I, I, I have. I, 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 I used to go to, to find out what your personal dentist has to say. Partly yeah, because I'm a good <laughs> alumni, but have you all talked at all to UD? Because they do studies on these sort of things on occasion. I remember when I was a junior, we looked at the lead paint in the fairgrounds neighborhood as a. Um, uh, project for one of our classes, and we were studying that. Have you all contacted UD and UDRI in particular, their research institute, to see whether or not this is of interest to right them? Right the same way. Yeah. It's a good idea. Yeah. Yeah. So, right contacting right. universities and their research well, institutes right. as labs well, are all well, certainly they're, they're high on well, the priority list because yeah. they are the experts. They're just doing the groundwork as yeah. a lot of. A lot of footwork, I guess. Where are you, yeah. where are you all <coughs> going to school? Because we've all graduated from high school this, this year yeah. or prior. Well, these students graduated. Oh, you're still in high school? This one is. I'm still no, in high school. He's, he's a still younger brother. Not, he's not. not. This, is, this, is, this is Alex Turpin's younger brother. Yeah. Okay. I'm on my way to Wright State. And I'm, I'm going to go to Sinclair for two years and then transfer to uh, uh, either Wright State or Ohio State if I can afford it. <laughs> We'll see how financially stable. Yeah, I leave for the. Oh, you're going in the military. I leave for yeah. Navy boot camp the fifth of October. What does yeah. the military do? You're not on escaping this, this water, are do you? Know? <laughs> I have no idea. As far as I know, they don't add what? to their. But I think they they use uh, municipal water source, as far as I know. So. I was thinking more along the lines of what's. The military. As far as I know, they use the municipal water source for everything. Oh, they have their own. Do yeah, they? Many yeah. of them have their own. Yeah. I'm not well, I'm sure the right pad is self-contained. <laughs> well, yeah, yeah, obviously the right pad is, but I know. No, I think, many uh, of the bases are. I like where I'll be. I'll be going okay, to nuclear engineering maybe. school in South Carolina, and it's just like a big dormitory. We're actually on base, so I Got figured it. they would be using Charleston's municipal well, water sources. Well, certainly on the ships, they don't have their own. Yeah, obviously, that's all. So, that's all. Pure purified water. They yeah, use the. Yeah. It's yeah. no, it's distilled. They use like. I'll be on. The, I'll be yeah. I'll be on the aircraft carrier. They use huge distilleries on the inside too, which so is. Do they for it? No, no. Make as sure far as I know, no, because it would be way too <laughs> way too much money, and they don't want they. Make sure you're not strip bear. Some, yeah. some fish or whale. Yeah. Digesting. <laughs> they they strip everything down on the ship. They minimal everything, so I don't think they would be. Can, can uh -huh. we wait until after? Labor Day, though, to put this on our agenda. This, that's so I mean, whatever, whatever, whatever time for us to get For ready. very selfish reasons, I'm going on vacation. <laughs> <laughs> I want to be here. Well, that's, entire, that's entirely yeah, right. Yeah, yeah, I'm going to be on Monday and a three-week gap, so the next meeting isn't even until September, th it's right. September 13th and, then and the 27th. We might explore or have other committee meetings that we could explore differently. I'd like to do a little research and just see if there's some other entities yeah, that have exactly. done uh, as a public a body, some type or, of resolution yeah. to support. You know, sometimes <laughs> even some of the groups that you guys have referenced have seen <coughs> uh, things that you know they distributed to different entities to promote a, a common uh, message. So uh, that's something I could definitely do. Okay. If you guys would be interested, I just need to make arrangements for you to speak to a uh, independent candidate for state representative for district. Oh my goodness. <laughs> so like to meet them, like to make Candidates them. don't count. I sort of had to work that. Something tells me I've, I've met or am in, in the process of meeting this person. Yeah. <laughs> Speaking to him. <laughs> okay, I think then we have something of a plan and I guess uh, researching and re reading as much as we've got hands on would be a good thing. Who's the okay, so contact of Alex isn't here? Uh, Alex is gone. Either, so I think either, we need until, to get either, either, until I leave, then him or, or myself. Okay. Yeah. If you guys maybe want to write um, your numbers down again, your emails, that would be great. Oh, well, they, they, on, they're on a sign-in list. Oh, okay. yeah, yeah, Bonnie did the sign-in. I didn't Which see the clipboard uh, here. The sign-in list just has some numbers. Okay. Make sure your email is over here. Oh, oh, I'll, 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 I'll let you put your emails in your names. Okay. Yeah, we'll that. That. That's why we're all technologically savvy. Yeah. Yeah. Just, I'll, I'll, we'll, we'll put our emails in. I know it's easy to get a hold of everybody these days. What? Okay. You might have made your name. So your spouse is starting today.
All right, guys. Finishing statements. Tell us, uh, tell us how you guys think it went, and uh, maybe some possible future prospects for uh, you know getting this issue. All right, you guys take I thought we did. I thought we did really well. Uh, I thought it, the council's reception was was pretty good. Uh, no laughing, anything like that. Mm -hmm. And uh, yeah, I, mean, I guess we're gonna follow pretty much what they said. I guess we have to wait for them to do the resolution and see what we can do for state. In September, hopefully, at a, another city council meeting, we'll have an open forum where other citizens can, you know, come and relate to this issue. So we really need to work on the publicity of it, which is just absolutely vital, you know. The way America is today, if you don't slap them in the face with it, mm -hmm. they're not going to know it's an issue. Now, so that's our next goal. Now, other people in other cities and counties and, you know, in other countries or other places in our country or whatever, like, what are some things that they can do to get this issue out and do what you guys did to take action? I think right now, uh, anything from going to your local city council, talking to them, even if you're in a different state, different municipality than we are, whatever, go to your city council, talk to your local paper, uh, just see what you can do to get it out. Repaste it on Facebook, put it on your blog, your website if you have one, just throw it out the internet there. internet is probably the best tool we have at this point. You know, we had uh, this article in our little local paper and it had 20-some comments, which actually really surprised me, you know, given how little of an issue I thought this would be with most people. But really, committees are where you gotta go. I would start locally, I would go to your local water, anything, anything with water in the name, go to that committee, because you know that they're the ones putting fluoride in your water, so they're the ones that get to talk to about it. And they're a little bread. They'll bring it before the city council, hopefully, and you know the city council actually receives some attention every now and then. Even if you're uh, in Ohio and you know state law doesn't do it, try and get a resolution. That's what we're doing. Just saying that the state needs to look at this again. It's been at least 40 years. You need to take a second look. Try and get your city council to do that. Try and get your city council to take a second yeah. look, make a resolution. I, I would say you know, first of all, I mean I thought this this was a was a great success tonight. Another step forward. And I think it also shows um, you know, whoever you know, views this or sees the photo, this or the video. This is a, this is a prime example of what can happen with just a little bit of you know oomph on your part. You know, all you have to do. I mean, especially if this works out and there's some, we can get to the state level and you oh, know, we're people, going. And, and get and get this to this to, to, to a point. We'll go to my legislature. But if but if we can get this to a point where um, each we we can change the Ohio Revised Code. To, to read, you know, any city that wants to opt out can opt out if and when they so choose. I mean, it's just one of those, you know, steps that we've made a difference to help you make a difference. That really you know? opens the so. door to, if we can get a change, if somebody can help us get a change, if we can go to the state and actually do this, mm -hmm. then it opens the door to anybody else that feels like doing a little bit of groundwork, going to their city council, taking the facts, taking all the studies that we and other research foundations have compiled, over years and years, take it to your city council, have a vote, put it on the ballot, do something. It all, it all, it all starts locally. I mean, yeah. you can't just you know go up to Columbus or wherever your capital is. Kick in the say, front door. And hey, how's it going? I want this done now. You know, you have to start locally. You have to get your, some name recognition, some uh, public education. You know, on your subject. You can't just you know, hey, uh, you know, be on my side because I said it's bad. You know, you have to. You have to, it's just like running for an office, but it's running for a cause, you know. It's, it's, it's running for something you believe in with the possibility of no reward, you know. It's, it's what, you, what you are striving for. And this is baby steps at a time, but we're getting there. And one last thing just to wrap it up. Uh, people that want to support you guys, viewers that are watching this video on YouTube, what can they do to help support you guys? Especially people in the Ohio area. Um, if, if you believe, I mean, if you, if you believe in what we believe in, uh, defluoridation of the water, you can help support us by getting the word out, or if you have a different cause. Get this video out? Get, yeah, get the video out. And But if you have a different cause, what you would want to promote, promote uh, use this video to help you uh, correlate what, you, what, what your move or your next move is going to be if you're trying to get something accomplished. Another big thing, if you want to help us directly, whatever, whatever you can do. Get a hold of the post, the people that are going to post this video, whoever it might be. Get it back to the source. There's Dayton Daily articles. Look us up on Facebook. Our names are out there. And just get in contact with us. Just talk to us and we'll see whatever you guys want to help with. Right Thanks on, everybody. man.
Never Ooh. give up is a big thing because if you give up, you know, especially, I mean, you think you're not doing much when you're at a, a city hall with, you know, seven, eight people, you know, that make all the rules for your city and stuff like that. You think, well, this don't mean anything because it's not the governor, it's not the president. I mean, it doesn't have to be that. Eventually you'll get there, but you can't, you can't give up on stuff like this. Awesome, dude.